Hi, this is a short video about how you can use multi-layer in NX. Suppose we have this uh, sheet metal part and we create a flat solid. You see the flat solid and the, and the flange. When you make the drawing for this sheet metal part, let me show you what happens here. You see, in the same view, we have the flat solid and the flange. So we don't want that, okay? We don't want these results. And when you create a new view, for for example the isometric view, we have the same problem. We have the flat solid and the flange in the same view. How can we fix that? How can we have only one uh, object in the in the view? Well, back to the sheet metal part. And then go to menu, format, move to layer. Select the object you want to play with it. In this case, the flat solid first. I'm going to put the number one here. Sorry, uh, it's number one. Okay. And for the flange, I'm going to move to a layer number two. Okay. Save the parts. And when you back to your drawing, go to menu, format, layer visible in view, select the view, which layer we want to view in this in this view. The flat solid, right? The flat solid is the number one is visible and the number two is invisible okay lie update you see we have the flat solid and do the same for the isometric view format layer visible in view select the view now the layer number one we went invisible and the layer number two went visible okay update your drawing you see a clean view okay now we can uh, extract a new view uh, sorry we can project this this view and you can apply some dimension okay wherever you want to do with uh, with this view okay so this is a simple tip how you can use multi layer in your in your drawing you can hide Features, lines, if you have an assembly, you can hide other components and you can do many things with multi-layers, okay, in NX. Thank you for watching.